Good morning, Rebels. Today is Tuesday, November 1st, 2016, and this is Rebel TV. Morning, everybody. My name is Andres Arceo, and I'm a sophomore here at Savannah High School. Would you please stand and join me for the Pledge of Allegiance? Put your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, and liberty and justice for all. Thank you. You may now be seated. Rebels, check your Google emails for information about the Positive Movement Tour. You have an opportunity to write an essay about how to make a positive change in our community and make a difference. Be sure to attend the football game on Friday, November 4th for entertainment, raffles, and giveaways from the Positive Movement Tour. Senior Rebels, the last chance to take your SAT and ACT is in December. The SAT is on December 3rd, but you must register by Thursday, November 3rd. The ACT is on December 10th, and the deadline to register is Friday, November 4th. Sign up now. HOSA members, on Wednesday, November 2nd, from 5 to 9 p.m., HOSA will be having a fundraiser at Chipotle in Anaheim. Make sure to pick up a flyer from any HOSA cabinet member or mention HOSA when you order. Don't forget to come out and support. Attention all students, here's a scholarship that is available to all, yes all. The Moose Youth Awareness Program provides scholarships and community service opportunities to students in all grade levels. Students must research topics and speak to a younger audience. An email was sent to your student email. Check it out. Scholarships range from 2000 to 12000 There are multiple steps, and the first deadline is coming up, November 10th. Check your email now. Rebels, come out to the Quigley Quad on Thursday, November 3rd, 2016 at lunch for the Community College Fair. You'll have a chance to get info on the online application process, each college's programs, a timeline of the application process, senior day information, orientation and placement dates, transfer procedures, and financial aid. Mark your calendars for Thursday, November 3rd. Attention senior Pontistas, come and join your fellow Pontistas from the AUHSD to learn what you and your parents need to anticipate during your last year of high school at the Puente 12th grade parent student workshop. The last year, what to expect on Tuesday, November 1st, 2016 from 6.30 to 8.15 p.m. at the Tiger Woods Learning Center. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Ruiz in the student center. Attention Bros Club members, there will be a meeting in room 20 today at lunch. We'll be discussing our current fundraiser and choosing who goes to the round table meeting this Thursday from 4 to 7 p.m. See you there. There is an interact meeting today in room 13 at 1225. If you are not able to attend, please see Ms. Forster sometime today. Also members, reminder, we have a meeting today at lunch in room 30. See you there. Hungry Rebels, today we will be serving chicken fajitas with corn tortillas on the salad bar. In the speed lines, we will have chicken box with mashed potatoes, pepperoni pizza wedge, taco nada, corn dog, pepperoni calzone, teriyaki rice bowls, spicy chicken sandwich, chef salad, assorted cold sandwiches, yogurt with string cheese or cracker, and peanut butter and jelly Uncrustables. Bon Appetit, Rebels! Hey Rebels, the Savannah Bus Club will be having a pre-sale of pizza this week. Pizza will be distributed on Friday after school in front of the gym. See any Bros Club member to buy your pizza. $2 for one topping and a drink, and $3 for two topping and a drink. Sale ends Friday. Hey Rebels, if you're nearby, the girls volleyball team will play at Westminster today at 7 p.m. It's been a crazy season, but the girls have held it together to make it to playoffs and will hopefully pull with the first round upset. Hope to see you guys there. Join us as we remembered our loved ones at the 5th annual Dia de los Muertos celebration in the Foreign Languages Plaza on Friday, November 4th. Altars, music, folklorico dancing, face painting, and tacos. Bring your family and a lawn chair to sit. The altars will be available for viewing from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. Pre-sale taco tickets in room 61. Now, enjoy the following short video as it shows the meaning of Dia de los Muertos celebration.
That's it for today's announcements, Rebels. Have a tremendous Tuesday.